It was a December to remember as all roads led to the Akwaba village in support of Ifwa Asantiwa Eduonum's Guinness World Record Singaton attempt. Another attempt took off shortly after. This time, the longest cooking by an individual, Nigeria's Hilda Bass's push, had gained continental attention. It therefore came as no surprise when Chef Failatu turned the attention to the northern part of Ghana with her cookathon attempt. The two women became pace setters. Their bold quest opened the floodgates for the season of record breaking attempts in Ghana, with the likes of 60 year old artist Mami deciding to chew gum for 47 hours. She gave up after seven hours. Patrick Amenuvo, who wanted to stand for 168 hours, also followed suit, giving up after barely four hours. Despite these failed attempts, Ghanaians still waited with bated breath for the outcome of the Efwa Edionum and Chef Faila to contest. Organizers of the award scheme announced that both attempts were unsuccessful. Chef Faila to is not perturbed by the outcome. God has filled me with a lot that I don't know how to put it before the world. I just need support to let the world see it. Cookathon was just an iota of it. And I'm grateful that God has given me the numbers and platform to now showcase all the others. So it's not going to be Cookathon. It's, it's going else. to be other things that are more than Cookathon. Ghana's chef mate has since February 1 been cooking, hoping to end on March 6th. But with two disqualifications, would chef mate give Ghana the big record it so desires. Only time will tell.